Hello and welcome to another practice session and this session is on cell biology and it is dedicated for IIT JAM 2022. This is the session number one. In this session we will practice 10 questions in next 20 minutes which are really useful for IIT JAM 2022 preparation. But before we start let me tell you that practicing previous year question is the key aspect for IIT JAM. So you need to practice the previous year question if you want to learn more about cell biology questions which were asked in the previous year you can click on this link right now and it is provided in the i button now you must be wondering what to do in the last three months and time is ticking out and there would be a lot of stress in the last moment and in this particular time you think that your concepts are weak you are not good at this you cannot do it but an academy can really help you with your preparation because the educators would analyze all the trends and prepare you accordingly. So this journey would be easier for you. Right now there is a 90 days crash course for IIT JAM 2022 biotechnology and this is the batch number 6 which is starting from 27th October. So why you are waiting for? Enroll right now. You can use my code AP10 to get a 10% discount. In this particular crash course, you would have a concept revision, MCQ practice. You can ask your doubts to the educators and there would be dedicated doubt clearing sessions where you can clear your doubt. So, you just need to download the app from your Play Store. You need to click on the link which is provided in the description. And you can use my code AP10 to get a quick subscription. It would give you 10% discount. Let's move on to question answer practice session. Which of the following has an opposite action to adenylate cyclase? Cyclic adenosine monophosphate, the active GTP alpha subunit of the G protein, then protein kinase A or phosphodiesterase. And here is the timer for you. You have to understand how adenylate cyclase work as an enzyme and you have to look for some enzyme or a factor which has an opposite or antagonistic effect that of adenylate cyclase. So the timer is about to be over and the correct answer is phosphodiesterase because phosphodiesterase has opposite effect or it breaks down cyclic AMP and if you want to learn more about it click on the I button. Question number two says when a cell releases a signal molecule into the environment and the number of cells in the immediate vicinity responds to that. This kind of signaling is known as autocrine, endocrine, exocrine or paracrine. So, your time starts right now. Now, these kind of questions are asked several times in many exams, especially in IIT JAM. This question was asked three times in last uh, 10 years. So, this is a very important question type. And the correct answer would be paracrine signaling. Question 3. You have added a microtubule blocker and another drug which blocks actin myosin cross bridge formation. Then which stages of the cell cycle would be affected? A flavor of these kind of questions are asked very frequently. Okay, So you need to know which drugs act on which type of uh, length of the cell cycle. So the answers are anaphase, metaphase, metaphase cytokinesis, telophase, prophase, prophase, telophase. And the correct answer would be, so before that, here is your timer for 20 seconds. Try to read the question and answer carefully. So these drugs uh, are really stereotypic, like the ones that are mentioned in these questions are really stereotypic. So you can list it out for your own convenience. And let's see what would be the correct answer. So correct answer for this question is B, metaphase and cytokinesis because microtubule involvement is there in metaphase, anaphase in these stages and cytokinesis relies on actin myosin interaction. Question number four, if you provide radioactively labeled glycine to the culture medium in which organelle will the radioactivity would be seen first and these are the particular answers. First mitochondria, then endoplasmic reticulum, endoplasmic reticulum, then Golgi, first lysosome, then mitochondria, first nucleus, then endoplasmic reticulum. Here is your timer. 
so you can check out my cellular traffic video which is in the i button to get a quick revision but the correct answer for this particular question would be as you have expected question number so endoplasmic reticulum and then golgi which of the following cytoskeletal element are associated with muscle contraction this is very easy and without wasting time we clearly understand this would be microfilament or the actin filaments if you want to know more about actin filaments click on the i button all the following statements describe functions of smooth endoplasmic reticulum which one of the following does not describe the function so you have to identify the odd man out here and the options are acr helps in membrane protein folding acr involves in cholesterol metabolism acr helps in drug detoxification acr helps in lipid biosynthesis and the correct answer would be acr helps in membrane fold membrane protein folding membrane protein folding is done in rer not acr if mitochondrial targeting sequence is replaced with the nuclear localization sig signal then the destination of the protein should be mitochondria nucleus cytoplasm or lysosome these are very easy questions and generally they ask easy question from cell biology and you can guess the correct answer here the correct answer would be nucleus right exactly okay question number 8 which of the following statement regarding cyclin dependent protein kinases is, is not correct which one of the following is not correct that you have to identify their activity is regulated by cyclins okay they can alter the activity of proteins involved in progression of the cell cycle their activity do not fluctuate during the cell cycle their activity is regulated by changes in gene expression protein phosphorylation and proteolysis correct answer is option c because their level do fluctuate over time okay which of the following statement is false in g1 phase cells experience external growth factor mediated signaling which leads to transcription of cyclin d1 gene in s phase dna replication takes place centrioles duplicate at g2 in metaphase the chromosomes are arranged in form of a metaphase plate so the correct answer would be centrioles duplicate in g2 centrioles already duplicate by s phase so obviously g2 is too late for that this is the false statement but these key events that are important in mitosis are one of the important aspect in iit jam so don't forget to revise that you can get the video in i button question number 10 which of the following process in mitotic prophase is unusual and unique in fungi this exact question was asked in iit jam 2016 and this is an important aspect because this is uncommon right and the options are chromosome condensation no breakdown of nuclear envelope the thread like appearance of the chromosome increased activity of mitotic like cyclins correct answer would be as you have guessed correctly no breakdown of the nuclear envelope so with that i'll say goodbye to you these are the 10 important questions in practice session 1 there are lots and lots of flash carded cards which are available in an academy which can help your preparation so take a subscription if you want you can always look at my animated biology with arpan channel where you can find playlists and cell biology playlist is always there if you want to quickly revise your concepts there are 56 to 60 videos which would help you to revise as usual like share and subscribe don't forget to follow me on instagram or facebook if you have any queries put it in the comment and do let me know how you like like the video thank you